Mad Mark 23. <laughs> Thank you for 12 months, Mad Mark. Happy anniversary, sir. Wait. It's doing something. No, it's sinking with steam, I think. I don't think it's in. I don't think it's patching. Yeah, I wouldn't recommend it right now, Aliki. Probably hold off until they fix the problems. Wow. I wonder if it's just the PC version that's like full on rip. Do you think the devs are watching? I don't know. If they are, they're probably going, oh my God. <laughs> Right, um, 1,700 XP. The next job gets us a level up. Let's see what we've got in the, uh, actually, what, have I got anything left in my inventory now? Well, I've got two rims left now. Sell. Yes. Yes. I reckon it was the, and they were both on 7%. The, two, the, the ones that I repaired screwed the game over. That's what I think happened. Look, my FPS is back to normal now. Okay, change engine all, put new timing parts in. The Royal Crown. What's that? What was that one then? I read a newspaper that time should be replaced more frequently than the old two. Please check them. That's the story mode. Let's take the story. You start seeing to force an update, Mad Bells. You think there's been another update? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, filter and drain oil. Is that it? Hey, That wasn't the spec. Did I take the wrong job then? I've already done the story twice. I know, right? This game is so broken. Oh my god. I see if this game has gone funny too. It probably has jewels. I can't see how we how we could avoid it. I thought I clicked on a different job. You wonder what Master and Dodge are thinking. Yeah. Yeah, I bet they're really happy. Okay, let's see a filter. Is it the third time when you got this car? Something like that. Pop that in. Cartoon head, thank you for the resume. That was generally funny though, that was. Happy anniversary, Nutter. No, it is a full release. It came out today. It's a full release. It's not a beta, it's not early access, it's a full release today. wait for the rim car to come back it's like groundhog day in uh, in story mode that's what it is you think I can get away with that there you are we just leveled up I think yeah we leveled up Looks like it's had a good bit of visual update from the last one. Oh, yeah. Have, have you been here long, Ferret? Because it's, uh, it's a bit broken. Unlocks a tablet, which apparently gives you the black screen bug. Instantly examine three parts when first seeing a car. Order, barn, junkyard, auction. 
unlocks the tire tread tester. With this tool, you can discover tires condition. You can use it through the pie menu while in the part overview. Successful repair chance increased to 55%. Hmm. Gives you access to the shop anywhere in your garage. If that worked, that would be great. Oh, yeah, Ferret. This game is, like, broken in so many ways. Ten minutes ago, you should have been here. It was, it was hilarious. Um, the tablet would be fantastic. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But if it's going to give me the black screen bug, it's not. You love how one of the icons is hitting a turbo with a hammer. That's how you that's how you fix turbos. What are you talking about, Ferret? That's all you gotta do. Frosty Jack, if you see someone doing a crossword today, just lean over and say, seven up is eleven eight. <laughs> okay. I get what you're doing though. Yeah, it's a good one. Frosty Jack. You got two points. I have got two points. So in theory, I could unlock something here, then something here. But get that, 55%. Get that, and we've got a 65% chance of breaking the inventory. 100% faster part examination. 100% faster screwing and unscrewing. I like the sound of that. Uh, unlocks the electronic meter. Simple but useful tool. Check all the electronic connections and resistances. You can use it while... Use it through the pie menu within the part overview. Unlocks the OBD. It will examine a lot of electronic computer connected parts not working in older cars. You can use it through the pie menu, blah, blah, blah. There's some good ones here. That's situationally occasional. That's not very useful. That one's always useful. That one's fantastic if it works. Let's try that. And then I might go for that. Although these are... Oh, the OBD scanner's useful. And the electronic meter's useful as well. Check all electronic connections and resistances. Examine a lot of electronic computer connected parts. These two and this one, they're all great. This one you can use all the time. This one just gives you extra diagnostics. I might do that one. No, I can't yet. I'm not allowed to. Oh, do I have to get one of these first? Happy anniversary. Or do I have to get that one before I get that one? Is that one dependent on this one? Is it like horizontally dependent then? Kind of feels like it is. But then if it was, I haven't got that, but I can get that, so I don't get it. CSJ90, 10 months. Wow, it's 10 months time flies. Stay awesome. Great job. Squirrel, love to you and your family. And love to everyone in chat. Stay awesome. Thank you, CSJ. Cartoon head. Thank you for two months. Seems like what? I think your level is too low. Yeah, right, okay. Examine three parts instantly. Unlocks the tire tread tester. See, these are a bit meh. I don't want to get these. I want to get this. It doesn't tell me why I can't have that. It doesn't say, oh, you have to have two in the previous column or something. No, I can't get I can't get anything in this column. At all. I can only get things in this column. So the upgrade cost is one. I have one point available. Why can't I get it? You need to be level two. How do you know that? You have to have one on the left of the box to get the next one. It's rubbish, isn't it? All right, we'll get that then. We'll get that. Settings, save. Right. Tablet. Ooh, tablet works. That's going to be useful. 
Right, let's get another job that we've already done before. Um, timing and oil again. God's sake. General running gear control and repair. Ooh. Not in that one. Gears we've not done yet. What else have we got? Ball brake performance. Let's try this one. Whoa. Holy cow, that's a big list. <laughs> you want me? Let's take it for a spin. It says level two, bottom right corner. Okay, I missed it, Marcus. Oh my god. First person. I think I missed, I missed that here. Yeah. Oh, it's so bouncy. Don't think these cars were very well known for slaloming abilities. Yeah, the RPM gauge for this £3.50 DLC is absolutely beautiful. Stop at some point today. So far, we've got buggy, grindy, poor driving physics, no tutorials, and borderline robbery DLC. The game's such a catch. Yeah. That about sums it up. One, two, three, four, five, six. Twelve items. Completely rip. Let's have a look. Ooh, I can see the little, uh, see a little rubber bush thing there. So the back left's fine. Apart from that, it's all full on rip. Right. Yeah, the RPM gauge on the Dodge is broken, and the best thing about this car, um, Ferret, is that this car is a three pound fifty DLC add-on. And the RPM gauge is broken on it. It's great. You could refund the DLCs. I could do, Connor. Probably. But I'm doing it for science. Um, I take it we're going to have to take the wheel off on that. Let's take this wheel off as well. Uh, the Jabba Penguin. Thank you for the resume, Jabba Penguin. No, I can't refund the game, unfortunately. Okay. Not that. That. Hmm. That's gonna have to come out. Take the shock out. Accessible when car is on the lifter. Okay. Uh, accessible when on the lifter. Rubber bushing. Check the condition of that. No, we can't chest test it. You have to te uh, path test that one. What, really? Gets okay, grown this side. Let's get that out of that. It's going to be a big shopping list going on here.
Okay, let's jack it up a bit. They should simulate the spring flying out and killing you when the compressor fails. That'd be a good sin. And it should uninstall the game straight after. Black mode. <laughs> right, overview mode. Oh my life. There's quite a lot broken on this. Okay, let's get that, and that, that's broken as well. Floaty McFloaterson. Why will that come off? Does it want me to do all this or something? This thing is just floating. <laughs> okay, we'll take all this off then. Hello, Custard. Loving the streams again. Looking forward to racing tomorrow. Watched all of them on Squirrel Plus uh, as a playlist. Much to watch. Thank you, Custard. Why well, want this? There we go. Uber faff. Will that come off now? No. Wow, that's a faff and a half, that is. Okay. Something sneaky going on here. Look, see that? We better get paid billions for this. Okay. That's the whole. Oh, wait a sec. We need to do that as well. Yep, that's rip as well. So much rust. This isn't even worth repairing. <laughs> it's like so completely broken. hoping I can repair some of this stuff. The last time I tried to repair things, it completely broke. Wait a sec. Completely broke the inventory of the game. There's going to be nothing left but nuts and bolts in a minute. Okay, that's the front end sorted. I've done this one before. Leaf spring is on 14%. The plate is broken as well. I take it that's going to have to come out. Blimey. 
This is nuts. Nevada plate, the car shouldn't be that rusty. Uh, the rear axle knuckle housing B. For which I think we're going to have to take this wheel off. We're in pretty deep with this one. Floating it floaters in. I think we have. Let's have a look at the inventory thing now. Okay. General running gear. <laughs> Gotta be joking. PC tech, privileged to be part of the great community and to work with a great bunch of mods. Continued success and all the best. Aww. Thank you so much, PC tech. Thank you for that. Um, tablet. Now, I need a lit. There's going to be a massive list of parts now. Assault by condition. That's not sorted by condition, is it? That's sorted by. That's sorted by randomness. That's not sorted by condition at all. Right, rubber bushing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven rubber bushings, I think. Random is not sorted. Hang on. My arrival. We don't want that. My name. We can go with name. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven rubber bushings I'm counting. So we'll, we'll get them ordered. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's by condition, just it counts percentage of parts that are in a group. Not very useful though if you want to just sort by condition, is it? Really? Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Right then. Sway bar front end link B. Sway bar front end link B. So two of them. Actually, let's try and repair some stuff. Actually, let, let me save it and then try to break my inventory. Apparently I can't can't repair anything. It's annoying. Repair with parts minimal condition 58%. A 58th? No, that's 53, I think. 53%. Right. Sway bar front end link B. We need two of those. Sway bar. Nope. Sway bar front end link B. Two of them. Yo, dog! I heard you like rust. So we've got you a car with rust on the rust so it can rust. <laughs> Let's get rid of that. Let's get rid of that. Right, upper suspension arm. We need one of those. This is a big job, this one. Upper suspension arm. $190. Get rid of that. 
No, I just got rid of something bad. I just got rid of something else then. What did I just get rid of? No, I must have got rid of one of them. Can't have been anything else. There must have been three of them. How can there have been three of them? Doesn't make any sense. It was the right part. Why have I still got two left then? Why have I got three? Why did... No, I didn't. I'm a bit... No, I've got two. Welcome back. Ignore me. Nata. Move along. <laughs> Solid rear drive axle. Solid rear drive axle. That's one of them. $137. Happy anniversary. Solid rear drive axle. Can get out of there. Uh, show stealer. Thank you for six months and a resume. Uh, parts when you are finished. Sell parts can be finished because you have some parts that are not from this car. Well, I'm kind of selling them as I go along, but we'll see what's left at the end. The wheel hub bearing. We need two of these. Wheel hub bearing. Two of them. Okay. Ay ay ay. We want a leaf spring and a leaf spring plate and leaf spring U bolts times two. So we're going to get very leafy now. So we'll search for leaf. We want a leaf spring, a leaf spring plate, and two of these U bolts. Oh, is it T for tablet? That's useful. Thank you. Is it I for inventory as well? That would be awesome. Leaf spring, plate, U-bolt, U-bolt. Rear axle knuckle housing B. Let's go for knuckle. Rear axle knuckle housing B. Hey, it is as well. Tie for inventory. <laughs> Actually works. Okay, there it is. Uh, front wheel hub. We have to take these apart, aren't we? I think. Don't know if I have to take that apart. Bottom suspension arm. Bottom suspension arm, that's that one. This guy's having a major overhaul. Flipping heck. Like rebuilding his car, like the six million dollar man. Right, the front steering knuckles C. Let's go for knuckle. Front steering knuckle C, which is that one. Uh, we want a front wheel hub and an inner tie rod. Front wheel hub and an inner tie rod. Front wheel hub. Yeah, it's our rod. We're nearly done here. Front sway bar B. Front uh, sway bar B. Which is that one, I think. Happy is this game worth it? Not at the moment. Front sway bar B. It's a bit buggy at the moment. I'd wait if I were you. I've seen some nasty ones. They are patching it, but I'd still wait for a bit. 
Uh, Lizbeth, 20 whole months spent wishing for the day I have a fluffy white dog like Doyle. Oh, thank you, Lizbeth. I take it you're going to Cosford as again, Lizbeth. Um, right, so we've just got this now. The double wishbone shock absorber, which I think we need to take apart in order to fix. With the magic tool that is here. Separate parts. There we go. There's a couple of pieces need fixing on this. And let's take parts of the spring. Separate. Oh my god, that one's completely broken. Look at that one. Let's see if we can rep any of this. <clears throat> it's a maybe for cost for the moment due to circumstances. Ah, okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. Uh, let's see if we've got any repair parts to do. Nothing at all. What a scumbag. Okay. Okay, we need two front springs. We need two front shock absorber caps. Front spring times two. Front shock absorber cap times two. Very dangerous to IRL. Yeah, I can imagine it is. Uh, the double wishbone shock absorber. We just need one of those. So we'll search for a wish. Double wishbone shock absorber. I think we've actually got all the parts now. Blimey. Okay. Hang on. Was everything in a minimum of 50... 53, was it? There's a 55 there. There's a 53 here, out of tie rod. I think it said 53. 54 there. I think it said 53. It looks like 53. It looks like an 8, but I think it's a 3. Let's put those things back together. Yeah, I would hate to use that machine. I really would. It's like a... It's like, I don't know. It's like a crossbow. <laughs> There's so many things that can go wrong with that. It's a 3, yeah, okay. Uh, did you start this sim with a clunker? What do you mean, le less that? Right, we've got everything. Let's see if we can actually put this thing back together now. Okay, leaf spring can go in. Camera can be a little bit awkward when you want to navigate your way around. Let's get the plate on. If this thing doesn't go back together, rip me. <laughs> that back. Oh yeah, we need to put the cylinder back on. And the shoes go back on. No. Does the wheel go back on now? I thought something had to bolt on though. There's like something missing. Drive it to see if there's any difference. Look at that. Shiny. Shiny, shiny. Oh, 
Oh, you stupid game. This had a bunch of faff parts in it, I seem to remember. together and we're going to go with a suspension arm with double rubber bushings I love the way you can do things out of order <laughs> do the upper one the hub cover. Yeah, I'm going to do the wheel in a sec. Hang on. I think that's all of that. Not bad, Kiwi. Okay. Let's come on this side. Suspension arm. Hey, Christian. Shock absorbers going in. Sway bars going in. I'll be amazed if this thing actually works. <laughs> I really will. Disc brake. Bearing. Cap. Brake pads. Brake calipers. How much do you reckon we'll get paid for this job? Anti-clockwise to tighten bolts, obviously. Let's have a look. <gasps> what is that? What is that red? What? Why the two red? What the heck? I replaced all the rubber. What? Doesn't make any sense. Two rubber bushings are red. Three rubber bushings are red. What the? Did I not get rid of the inventory? Oh, you scumbag. How did that even happen? You reckon I get paid a thousand? You took the bad rubber bushings out of the frame on the car. Eh. Eh. Dang it. I thought I sold all the bad stuff. God. The thing is, there's three rubber bushings that are bad at the moment. Let's get rid of that one. Right, so I don't have any now that are below spec as it were where's the third one though unless that was two and now I need a rubber bushing
Let's look for Bush. Who was that? Dr. Geetham. Lord Soccer just told me he wants to hear everyone's best car puns. Have at it, nutters. <laughs> Everybody's best car puns. Without Googling, I might add to that. No items to work with. Looks like I need another one. What? Bottom suspension armor. Are we saying I don't have this anymore? What the heck is my... What the... Where is the bottom suspension arm just gone? Did I actually sell that, or did that just inventory bug me out? Because I don't remember selling that. I think it bugged out on me. I'm honest. Six percent. Unless I somehow accidentally sold that, which I really don't feel like I did. Jaw stats with 19 months. It's my birthday today, and I'm able to catch the live stream too. My day is complete. Happy birthday, Jaw stats. Hope you had a good one. Oh, for the love of God. How can that st How? How can that be read? How can they all be red? One, two, three on this side are red. One, two on this side are red. You just saw me do this. The car is bugged. The £3.50 DLC is bugged. You literally just saw me do that. And it's saying... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven rubber bushings are in red. You reckon a restart's going to fix this? Too bad you can't rewind the stream. Well, when people are watching this on Squirrel Plus, so if you're watching this right now on Squirrel Plus, which you will do in a couple of days' time, um, rewind back and have a look. It's the results of this test drive, the extra bushings in the subframe. <laughs> Refunded and asked for interest. Yeah, I want a refund. And I want my time back, please. I want you to refund me three and a half hours of my life. <laughs> Did they not test this properly? I mean, I don't get it. It's still broken. The restart didn't do anything. Remember to put the bushings back in the frame. Hey? I don't have any parts. 
I don't know. I don't know if we can fix this. Press the finish order. Car is incomplete. There is bracket zero missing from car. <laughs> Happy anniversary. Just genius. Pit TC, 10 months. Please don't mind me just sharing the resub. Just your typical lurker sharing a resub here. Nothing to see here. Thank you, Pit TC. Lurk away, bro. Right. From, from this, I can see that one, two... Three rubber bushings on this side. Love of God game. And one, two, three rubber bushings on that side are red. Okay? For the very last time, I'm going to disassemble those and replace them. Database index is corrupted. Try not to sell until you finish building the car. Happy anniversary, Nutter. Well, I can't finish the car off, can I? That's the problem. So. Okay. Take that out of there. Pull them apart, then repair them again. I'm not gonna. I don't repair the bushings. I replace them. That's the thing. Looks like we don't have to take the wheel off. This is hilarious. We're gonna have a floating wheel in a minute. Oh no, no no, it won't let me. The up the upper one won't come off, that's fair enough. Steve Dunn <coughs> Can we give Steve Dunn a nutty welcome guys? Thank you for subbing Steve. Welcome to the net house. Okay. So we should now have six rubber bushings that are broken. Let me sort by condition. One, two, three, four, five, six. There you go. You're missing the bushing in the front of the frame as well. Hey? Well, I might be wrong, but where you was unbolting the top and bottom arms, there was an empty space for a rubber bushing, which would make seven. The subframe has four bushings that you remove, but haven't put back. Oh, aye, 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 aye. You mean here? So we'll put back a 68% one, yeah? Go on, let me navigate my camera over here. There's a 59% one going back in. Okay, so the two on the subframe are there now, yeah? One, two, three, four, five, six. So we're going to sell the six and we're going to buy six new ones. Mikey with 100 bits. Hello, Paul. I think they released this game far too early to keep up, uh, keep up the great streams. I agree, Mikey. I think this is... Uh, e even... Even a even a somebody new to testing could have played this game and found these problems. The two on the back of the sub room as well. All right. Well, let me order. Let me order some rubber bushings because it sounds like we're going to need a four billion of them. Okay. So we're going to need six for the front, and we're going to need two on the back. So we'll go with eight.
One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight brand new rubber bushings, yeah? Eight brand new ones. Where did they go on the back then? Or was it the, the front of the back? Or the back of the front? Back of the front, wasn't it? Here. Come on, let me over there. Thank you. Oh no, this one's already on apparently. We never took that one off. Okay. Put the parts together first. And how do we do that? How do we do that? How can you assemble this before you put it on? Yeah, I should have one bushing left over, Alan. Exactly. Aye, 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 aye. Nutty boy. Been playing for two hours and had no bugs or problems, lol. Just your luck. What? You must be the only person on this planet who has got no problems right now. How can you say that? You're not playing the game hard enough. So there we go. 100% rubber bushing. 100% rubber bushing. Assemble in bolted. Okay, right. I'm now going to examine, and you can see that I just put brand new rubber bushings into that arm, and they are red. I declare a bug. That is a hundred percent broken. Did you change the bushing fluid? There is no bushing fluid. See, I can't finish that job because I can't convince the game that they are 100% bushing. Because every time it puts them in there, somehow, it swaps them with broken ones. How do you get a refund on DLC? I can't remember when I bought it now. Time to buy the DLC. Uh, Steam purchase. Oh, 1903. Are you serious? Two and a half hours ago. I've gone past my time. I'm 30 minutes over. You can't get refund on a DLC. Why? It's broken! How long have you used it? Not when you bought it. Oh, yeah, but I've been... Oh, mm, no, I've been using it since I bought it, haven't I? You can still request it through Steam. They just have to approve it. Yeah, well, I can't fix that job. <sighs> that is so, so, so annoying. My refund just waits, it's fixed. Well, I can't continue, can I? Because it's broken. Check your inventory, why? What am I looking for? Where's the set fire button? <laughs> the bushings are still there. What do you mean? I bought. You saw me buy like eight of them or something. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Your advice is to have a beer. Jules, who persuaded you to get the DLC? Blame that person. That would be somebody rhyming with jazz. Hmm. 
I forget his name now. It runs with Jazz. Jazz Bard. Something like that. Ken Fenton. Squirrel, go to Steam website. And for the two hour limit, it doesn't apply for DLC. Love the streams. And one question, what is better, G25 or G27? Uh, G27, I would say. The upper suspension arm is bolts, not bushings. Now, there's a bolt that goes through the bushing. You don't, you don't buy the bolts in this game. Okay, well, anyway. What if you try and finish the job anyway? I can't. I can't finish it. Quick say, it won't let me complete the job because it says there are rubber bushings that have not been fixed. Even though I've just bought brand new ones. You don't, Trucker Jay. I, I literally have done this twice now and it's still broken. Welcome back, Nutter. I ev it even threw away the bottom arm and I bought a brand new arm with brand new bushings, put it in and it still broke. Griggs, thank you for the resume, Griggs. Right, let's have a look. What's been updated? Has Sim Airport been updated at all? Happy anniversary. Move the car to garage. Honestly, until they fix that, I can't be bothered. 40, 14 months, Griggs, thank you. Don't sell any parts until after the job is done. And they say you should keep the old bushings in the inventory until the car is finished. Who says that, Baz? Who's saying that? Well, I, the thing is, Baz, is I already sold the old bushings. They already sold them. I can't bring them back, can I? You had parts missing, it doesn't matter if they're not 100% fixed. I, I don't... This doesn't make any sense to me. I don't think you're understanding what's going on. Thank you for the host, Flying Jackal. Let me show you. Again. <laughs> right. Okay, guys, step by step, walk me through how to fix this and complete the job then. The bug thread on CMS 2018 is already 58 pages. <laughs> oh my god. So the way I think we fix this is you wait until they fix the game. But if you're convinced that I can fix that, tell me how. It's a bug. It's even on the Steam page and the developer knows. There you go. Install bushings on the work table. Okay. The work table. What what work table? This one? The repair bench? You mean do it on here? Because all I can do here is repair. I can't do it. I can't assemble here. I don't believe. Take the parts off, but don't sell the broken bushes. Just mount it with new ones. Okay, so we go into... So we take the part off, yeah? Take the parts off, but don't sell the broken bushes. Just mount it with new ones. Okay. So if, if I buy some new ones, because I'm going to need a few of these, aren't I? Which I don't know how many I'm going to need. So, we go back into assembly mode, and we put on a new arm. And we'll pick some new 100% ones, yeah? Like that. Alright? Alright. 
Okay, they're still red. And in my inventory, I now have two more red ones. So what do we do? Just do that again. Take it back off. This, this thing is 100% converting... Look, I've now got four broken rubber bushings. So if I do it again, it's just going to keep doing it, surely. No, no, the one, they're not. They're not ticked on papers done. That's the thing. In here, they they constantly show up as broken. Uninstall and never talk of it again. <laughs> no, you can't buy the complete suspension arm, no. You have to buy the arm and the bushing separately and then assemble them. No, I don't... Rage Monster, I don't know of any way to mount them separately. The only opportunity you get to mount them is when you... Or assemble them is when you go to mount it. That's the only time you get that option. Unless you can do it here, which I don't think you can, because this is not really... See, it's not really built for that. Yeah, but the new arm, Christian, doesn't have the bushes in it. Anyway, I, honestly, I think it's uh, I think it's broken. Return to menu without saving. Yeah, I could scrap the job and get another one, Hayden. But what if I get another job and that's got a bug in it? Like, honestly, it seems like the game is not finished. They need to go and sort it out. We'll look at it again when it's fixed. That's my um, my take on it. 